Good evening. Residents from two tent cities being evicted from their current sites now have a place to go. But people at Hope City don't want to share the land with residents of Camp Runamuck. The chief of a local Indian tribe has volunteered his land in Cumberland near the intersection of Minden Road and Martin Street for the new homeless camp. Eyewitness News reporter Catherine Sotting is live at Hope City in Providence with tonight's top local story. Well, Mike, another twist tonight in the Tent City Saga. The people here behind me at Hope City say tonight they are now moving to an Indian reservation in Cumberland. I'm saying uh, if, if they have no place to go, why not to the reservation? Chief Wilfred Eagleheart Green of the Seekonk Wampanoag tribe extending his invitation Friday night to the dozen or so tent city dwellers in Hope City. They'll now be moving to what the chief calls his deeded property. We will be utilizing their reservation land up in Cumberland, Rhode Island. To be exact, the chief says about a mile and a half of reservation land off Menden Road and Martin Street in Cumberland. The Hope City people say they made the deal after they were forced to move from their current spot under the 195 ramp. They have to be out by the end of the month. The chair of the group says members must follow the same rules once they move to Cumberland. To live here, there's rules you got to follow. You have to be looking for work and stuff like that. I go to Craigslist and I pick up daily jobs here and there, which is not enough to pay for rent. But, I mean, it puts a little bit of money in your pocket. And while Friday night the chief originally said the land is open to all homeless people, the leaders of Hope City say it's not open to the 40 or so people at Camp Runamuck that are also looking for a new place to live. Do you worry about any liability if there were a fire? You, you, you know, I, I, I didn't think about that, but um, I don't. I don't see what you know what what's going to burn. I, 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 you know, I you know I can't. No big houses or anything. Now, as for when they are moving, they will not say. Again, they do have to be out of here by the end of the month. I did call Cumberland Police tonight as well. They tell me they've heard nothing about this. Reporting live tonight with the Providence Mobile Newsroom, I'm Catherine Sotnik, Eyewitness News.